One of the most anticipated movies of 2022 came out, and that is Jordan Peele's Nope. And overall, I enjoyed it. I really did. Um, I think now, really seeing three of his movies, he's someone that tries to blend the literal with the metaphorical. And depending on uh, you know how well that works for you is going to be directly proportional to your enjoyment level, right? And you know, in that sense, I think uh, this movie Nope kind of falls in between uh, both Get Out and and Us, where Us tried to be sort of more metaphorical, and the logical kind of lost its footing there. Um, get out is a lot more uh, literal and the metaphorical, you know, works off of that. Um, as I said, this one kind of falls in the middle and hence for me, my ranking would be get out, nope, then us. Now, the, the, the spectacle of it all is really there. I think it's shot beautifully. It's shot by the same cinematographer who works with Christopher Nolan and IMAX cameras, right? So the same guy who did... Interstellar, Dunkirk, Tenet, and so forth, right? And you can, at least for me, I can really tell that it's done by the same guy, and that's really wonderful. You know, Jordan Peele wanted to go into this making the movie a spectacle, and I think um, certainly that's a theme of the movie, as you'll see, um, but it he certainly achieves that. Now, you know, overall, that's great. Um, like with all Jordan Peele movies, there's a lot that's crammed into it, um, which at times does work in its detriment. I think, you know, Kiki Palmer and Daniel Kaluuya, they play brother and sister of this Hollywood horse ranch. And, you know, they, you can tell that they have a dynamic. And for me, because of how great the dynamic was, I wish that was explored a little bit further. Um, you know, seeing the bond, seeing what makes them tick, because then I think that would have gave me a more emotional investment into the story and made me really root for what they're trying to do um, because sometimes it does rely on, rely on just actions, right? Of like, okay, they're just going to do this, right? Um, so I, I, I wish it leaned a little bit more into that emotional aspect of it, but overall, as I said, um, I did enjoy it. Um, uh, I think, you know, for better or worse, Jordan Peele always makes me think and, and leaves an impression. And I think that's a sign of a good artist in general. So for all those reasons, um, I recommend seeing Nope. Uh, and when you do, let me know what you think.